Hi, this is Ray Madrid here once again with video check-in 2.2. On this one, I'm going to show you the progress I have so far with my Behance CO application using the Behance.net API. Uh, let me go straight to it, open my Firefox. So here's my my homepage to the Behance CO web application. As you can see, this is a, a call, basic call to action. I haven't really designed all of it. But on this one, what I want the user to do is click on this button so that when they click on it, they're going to be able to see the top 10 uh, portfolios on Behance. So this is what I have so far. Basic dummy tile here. I'm still getting errors to my API. I'm getting this huge error right here for some reason I still need to fix it but the point is when they click on the project they're able to see the details see all the details of the of the project the views the likes the comments about the project and uh, and the tags and of course the the user the author of that project and this is where they're able to see the project itself so you can see it's responsive um, I got my links working on my top navigation bar over here. So top 10 takes you here. Of course, sign in. Now for this project, I don't think I'm going to have a sign in functionality. This is just the views. I don't know if it was required, but I still got it done. Um, regardless, this is these are my routes here working. Everything looks to to be working fine and this is the actual API working here the only thing is that this one um, and this view I use raw JavaScript I didn't use nothing with with angular and I'm still having trouble trying to translate what I did here onto my controller and make that work with my with my HTML and the angular JS go straight into the code so I can show you what I got going on and how how this is all working all right. To start off here, I'm gonna go into my configuration where I have my my main um, application controller, and this is where I have my routes. Um, when the user is just there's no directory, it's just empty. It's gonna take them to the to the views main HTML, which is here inside my views folder, and then when they click on a detail what it is is the, the project when they click on it it's going to take them to the to the detail HTML uh, listing this is where all the all the projects this was going to be pulling all the all the all the, um, the 10 top 10 portfolios this is the listing of course the sign in and sign up forms and if there's an error with whatever let's say they misspelled the or there's a link that doesn't take them anywhere it's gonna direct them back to the empty one which is gonna take them into the main HTML where you can find the the CTA and the welcome to Behance your app okay now let's see let me show you my controller um, this is my my core controller here I'm declaring all these variables with my base URL using behance.net slash v2 this is where it's going to connect using uh, I'm also declaring my username Enoch Madrid of course I'm going to have a database of 10 users right now I'm still I'm still trying to set up with one user and make this happen uh, for some reason it's not working but um this is my API key right here um function get projects this is where it's storing the URL using these variables to get to the the actual um, location of the the projects so this is my get projects function I also have a init function here which is basically the same thing I'm just trying to figure out which one's gonna work best or it's pretty much the same thing you go to my listing. The listing is where I'm gonna pull the um, the projects, but um, 
as you can see right now I still have this dummy page this dummy tile here as a project which is the last one right here everything static is pulling from my files like the images and it's just just static HTML my images here I just put a sample JPEG this div I'm using all the all the attributes using angular to make this work using the ng app app core my controller core my initializer um, function get projects and I'm using the ng repeat projects inside list projects and it's supposed to take me to the detail of the project ID the link and then of course a project title by project username project tag how many views and how many likes of course there's a lot of work that needs to be done so far this is what I got I'm trying to get at least this work in here yep that's what I got so far so you can see everything's responsive got my menu sign in I mean it's looking nice but I'm not really happy with the functionality for some reason I can't get that API working but um at least this is what I got so far as far as um pivotal tracker I got all I don't think I'm going to be doing a crud I don't see it necessary for that auth authentication again I don't with with the Behance API there's barely any way of doing authentication using OAuth or, or however you say that um, that's big trouble so I'm not gonna be doing no no user login I just put the forms just to put them there because they're they, they were asked to do these like sign up page but um yep this is what I got so far this is what I got going on thank you for watching